Hello and welcome back to the Hunter Call of the Wild. So right now I've got a fallow deer male coming in. Uh, so we're just kind of waiting on him. And here he comes. We've got the new bear claw razorback. Hopefully we can get a shot before he spooks. Looks like a vital hit. Well, I didn't mean to draw back again. So it looks like we had the bug where they kind of freeze there. So we just had a very easy fallow deer. Uh, but I've learned a good bit uh, about the game since I last played. Uh, about consecutive harvest and how like the bronze, silver, gold all works. Uh, so it actually is related to the integrity. Uh, the trophy integrity of the animal. And of course uh, the trophy rating. Or just the... I think the score also goes off of that. And maybe that directly uh, influences bronze, silver, and gold. I'm not 100% sure about that. I did complete the mission that we were stuck on last time to take a picture of a fallow deer. Um, someone said that you need to spot the animal. But actually, as it turns out, I just wasn't in the right region. Uh, and I was talking to a guy uh, that I know that plays the game a lot more than I do. I think he's like level 40 already. Got another fallow deer male. Um, and he said you don't have to spot them. It's just a matter of uh, getting the zoom correct on the pictures so if you guys were curious about that uh, that is what he said and I got the picture no problem when I was actually in the right region so if you look at the missions I'll show you in one second if you go to the mission log uh, in the right I'm not sure if you can see my cursor if you can I'm kinda of pointing to it uh, but on the top right it says travel to Rathenfelt spot three different fallow deer in Rathenfelt at night is my mission so I have to actually be in Rathenfelt to do that uh, and then if you look at the a picture for her book, the uh, the mission where you have to actually take the picture of the fallow deer, it does say to travel to Rathenfeld. It doesn't actually say take a picture of one in Rathenfeld, but as it turns out, that's what you have to do. Uh, so as soon as I found one in Rathenfeld, it was no problem. But also, as I'm seeing some fallow deer running around out there, um, I seem to have a bug where weapons are just insanely heavy uh, in the inventory. So I can only carry like two. I've got the bow that I just showed you, and I've got the 357. So we'll get a few kills with the bow, uh, just to show off how it looks. Uh, basically, if I get out the right weapon, it is just a reskin of the other uh, Bear Claw Razorback, uh, but it was like to celebrate one month uh, since the release. So I just got it. I think it was only 6,000 cash, which is not bad. Uh, they've been adjusting prices for ammo and stuff as well. Uh, a lot of good updates and that sort of thing got a whole lot of fallow deer out here so yeah we'll get a couple kills with this new bow uh, and then I'll probably just go get my 7mm just to keep things going I did kill some red deer and some European bison uh, since the last video and it was funny my first three red deer were mythical very hard and hard and those are the only three I've killed uh, so high uh, difficulty and score uh, and I just haven't even seen, I've seen females, I just ended up shooting males. But anyway, that was a long intro. And uh, we'll try to call in this fallow deer and get him with the bow. Alright, we've got fallow deer absolutely everywhere. Uh, as you can hear, they're somewhat uh, alerted to my presence. I'm trying to crawl absolutely as slow as possible. Just to see if I can even see one. There's a few there. I'm just not seeing any males. Uh, I know there's two here. I have seen them. But I think we're going to take a female just so we end up with something. Alright. That's sending them all out of here. Let's see what we got for blood. Looks like a vital hit. Oh, maybe not. A non-vital hit. Uh, which I do believe will take them down fairly quickly. As long as we can get on the right tracks. Is this run? No, it's trot. So, somewhere... I know she went this way. There's just dozens of tracks absolutely everywhere. Alright, so our fallow deer's down, and we got a warning call from another male. Probably one of the males who was in the herd with this one. So we'll just try to call him in. And we'll grab our female. So yeah, I think it was a medium bleed rate, so she didn't 
uh, take that long to go down. I think non-vital hits are usually like intestine, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, intestines. But that'll keep our consecutive harvest bonus going. And we'll see about this male. Alright, we've got a roe deer female coming in. Actually, uh, I think I was going to say she'll be in range, but she kind of just stopped there in the brush. Uh, the fallow buck had pretty much no interest in coming in and ended up spooking, so uh, no sign of him. But also, I should mention this bow. Uh, it is a free DLC. You just have to actually uh, acquire enough cash to get it in-game. Uh, but yeah, pretty cool. I think this is probably going to be our last kill with it. Uh, and then I'm going to fast travel, and I'm going to grab the 7mm and we'll do some red deer and potentially some European bison hunting uh, since we've not had them on video yet. I don't really know where our road deer went. Oh, there she is. Hiding in the brush. If I could get the right weapon. Oops. Alright. She's down. We'll grab her. Double lung shot. 41 weapon score. I think I'm getting close to being able to get uh, the three pin sight for bows. But we're going to fast travel up here to however you say this region. I know it's not Spreeberg, but that's what I'm going to say. She said it a lot different than that uh, when I went to the lookout point. Alright, we've got a European bison right here. It's actually moving our way, but it just noticed us got a broadside angle I'm not sure if that was gonna be shoulder blade whoa is it gonna charge us not if we do that I did get charged by one other it was the first time an animal actually uh, managed to injure me uh, I didn't even know it was there it just uh, came flying out of the forest and ran me over but our first European bison on video, and actually, it's kind of in a nice spot. I've started taking more pictures like this uh, lately. Alright, so just a trivial difficulty female, and actually, okay, we did catch the left lung uh, on the first shot, even though just barely, and then the second shot was right through the lung perfectly. Very nice. So I'm just kind of heading uh, towards, where is it at? This lookout point here. So just to unlock more of the map and potentially find an outpost down there so I can fast travel over that way. Got a red fox. I've only, uh, only got the 7mm on me because the weapons... Uh, seem to be bugged, unless that is intentional, but I imagine you're uh, supposed to be able to carry several weapons with you. Uh, so, we'll take them if we see them. Uh, but yeah, I want to find that outpost. And I don't know if there's any red deer uh, along the way, uh, but this is the area that I found red deer in before, so it's quite possible. I hear, oh yeah, there's another bison there. And apparently that red fox. There's multiple other bison. Trying to get to where I can see, but apparently this bison's going to get super close. I can't even see it. I can just hear it. There it is. Don't want it to get too close. That is a vital hit. Is that a male? I think it is. Yeah. I don't know. They're kind of all heading that way. I'll just take it slow uh, until we find it because usually you get low bleed rate uh, with the 7mm on the bison unless you can get medium. Let's see. Oh yeah, it's not on the first track, but that was the highest difficulty male I've seen. I've only seen threes and that was a four. Uh, so we'll probably try to get him. Uh, just for uh, the fact that he was a male. But yeah, I'll just kind of take it slow tracking. So hopefully we just kind of find 
uh, this one that we got, and then the other shouldn't be too far away. Alright, so the issue is there's a female, and now there's not. I was going to say covering up uh, our angle on the male. Uh, but this other female is getting pretty close. Luckily, she just turned around. Because uh, I do want to wait for a better angle. I don't want to end up uh, making a poor shot on the bison, because that will definitely require a follow-up shot. Looks like we're about to get the shot we want, though. There we go. And he turned directly around. <laughs> he did give us a broadside shot for a moment there. Oh, boy. We're just going to go for a headshot. Okay, that dropped him in his tracks. Cool. I was getting to the point that that was our only opportunity uh, to get him. So, okay, there's another one. <laughs> it scared me a little bit. Got our mail. We had a brain shot. Silver. Not too bad. I'm hearing another one uh, moving around, but we'll try to get back on the blood from the other one that we shot and go find it. All right, so our female bison's down right here. We did have medium bleed rate. Uh, so, and we had a liver right lung, so pretty solid shot. I did change my uh, distance units to uh, Imperial, so it's like miles, yards, pounds, that kind of stuff. Uh, I guess pounds isn't distance, but units in general. Uh, so if you're wondering why things may look different, that'd be why. Alright, I hear footsteps, and yeah, it's a uh, road deer female. I ended up not going to that lookout point because I found myself between it and a large body of water that I didn't feel like going around. Uh, so I'll worry about that later. Hiding perfectly behind a rock. Uh, but what I do want to do before this video is over is find a red deer. Just because we've not yet killed one of those on video. Alright, so our road deer's down. So yeah, I'm back... Try to show you where I'm at. Up here. And like I said, I found a fair amount of red deer up here. So hopefully we can find uh, at least one for this video. We'll see. Well, sadly, I cannot find any red deer. Uh, and I do not have much time uh, left to record. So I guess we'll just take one of these bison uh, to end off this video. So still no red deer uh, on video, but like I said, I did kill three pretty good ones. Of course, wasn't recording uh, during that time. I believe that's the mail there. Should have been a solid shot. Now, is he going to charge? Because I'm curious why they do that. Yep. Alright, so good to know. He just ran right into a bullet before he made it to me. <laughs> I think that's the one that we shot anyway. Actually, maybe not. It does look a bit lighter. No, that's the one. Oh, we shot a female. Oh well. So yeah, not a bad hunt, unfortunately. Just couldn't find any red deer. I still don't know exactly uh, where to look for them, but... By the next video, I should have more of the map figured out and kind of have an idea of where to find red deer more consistently. But with that, thank you guys for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Leave a like if you did. See you in the next one.